Hello guys, and welcome back to Blue Lock. It's been it's been three months. Um, yeah, that's that's good started. I, I don't want to waste time. I'm gonna focus on Blue Lock. I want to get this finished. Um, you guys want me to get this finished. Uh, yeah, the ball mechanics are looking good. Uh, let's check them out. It's it's been a while since I've been in this uh place last time. So yeah, you can pick up the ball. Look, this cool bar. Uh, that's the first thing I'm gonna actually do is I'm gonna set my character to R6. So you can actually do this by going to Avatar now, because if you try to do this in the game settings, it won't work. And then you go to Avatar settings, and then you just hit the three dots here and put R6 only, save changes, and then save and restart. Uh, yeah, and now our character is in R6. And we can check if everything works as it's supposed to in R6 as well. So we pick up the ball. We can aim, we can shoot, and as you can see, um, with the mouse, aim like aiming with the mouse won't do anything. Uh, so we want to actually look up and then shoot the ball. Look up and then shoot the ball, I said. And then you can see it shoots up. We also, I think, did the flying thing. Yeah, we did this. Did we also do dribbling? How do I dribble? Oh, yeah, we did dribbling on serve, I think. Let's actually check uh, what the dribbling hotkey is because I completely forgot. Um, dribble, 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 dribble. No, 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 no. Q. Q. So yeah, Q is dribbling. We can actually check this in our attribute, I think. I think we made this with an attribute. Okay. For some reason, it's not turning. But I think it's turning on the server, so... Okay, it's not turning on, but it should work, I think. Uh, let's see if it's Q. Pass ball. Uh... Okay. Let's just check this without doing anything. Because maybe we broke it in the last episode. Uh, let's check. Okay, it works. Oh yeah, it, it works. Okay. This also work if we shoot the ball and then collect it. Let's check. Yeah, it does. Okay. Yeah, we're fine. Dribbling works. Uh, that's perfect. Uh, so now actually, since the ball system is quite good progress, I want to get into the kind of technical thing where you kind of like roll the styles. So we're gonna make a new. Module scripts here in our folder, which we're going to call modules. Put this in here. I'm going to call this um, uh, main. And in this, we are going to add our uh, styles. We're going to add our flows. We're going to add our rarities. And that's pretty much. It's uh, yeah, so what I want to do is in our flows, we just need to name the module flows, and then we can just start with uh, flows dot chances and our flows dot lucky chances. There we go, and now we just do this for the styles as well. Copy styles, paste, 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 and paste. There we go. Then rarities. Copy the rarities. Paste, paste, and then rarities dot rarities. And let's actually start here. So let's go ahead and put a rare here with a table. And we have basically just put every single rip uh, like thing here. So we have epic, I think it was called. We have legendary. Uh, we have myth mythical, I think. I, I don't know the rarities anymore. Yeah, we just want to go ahead and enter a color. So, to 
go ahead and see colors, see the color 3 from RGB, and then get a nice blue, like this maybe. So one just pink me on this guy, one second. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're going to pretty much just copy this and paste this into every single kind of thing here. No, this was wrong. Okay, so epic, let's choose a nice purplish. I think I'm gonna pick this. Legendary, I'm gonna pick my gold, and mythical, I'm gonna pick the red. Slightly don't make this darker, like this. These are our colors, our rarities. Uh, now, here in the chances, what we want to do is lows dot lows first stuff. We want to just make a table. This is where all of our flows will go. And in the styles, we just want to make styles and styles. This is where all of our styles will go. Uh, so this is all styles. And this is all flows. Um, and then our chances. And you want to just get the rarity module, so uh, local rarities is going to be equal to require script dot parent dot rarities. Let's copy this over to our styles, and then we just want to start here, where we just put uh, rarities dot rarities dot uh, rare, and we assign this to a percentage, maybe like seventy percent. And then we just do this for every single one. So we do rarities dot rarities dot epic. We put this to maybe 20%. Rarities dot rarities dot legendary or maybe 25%. We put the legendary to be equal to 4%. And then rarities dot rarities dot mythical. We put this equal to 1%. Uh, double equal. Don't forget the double equal. And then for the lucky changes, we just adjust them. So for the lucky, I just want to have epic with uh, 10% or with 0% actually. Uh, epic with 70%. Uh, legendary with maybe like yeah, 25. And mythical with 5%. So this is just how this will go. I'll just copy over both tables and paste them into our flows. Uh, like this and like this so this is now our chances table pretty much so this is where all of our chances will go and all of our flows will start uh so yeah now we can start with some functions so in the main this is where our functions will be so function main and then um random rarity and then we want to pass random low rarity and then also random random style rarity and then we just want to get our rarities so uh, what you want to get is lucky as well. Okay, so we want to do our local local chance. So our local um, what's it called? Our local random is going to equal to math dot random uh, one and one hundred. And then our local, yeah. And then we just want to check if it's in these boundaries here. And then we just want to return it. Actually, before we do so, let's go to our rarities again and then do uh, rarities dot order and be equal to, and then just put. Uh, 
rare. What's happened here? Okay, a rare, then epic, then legendary, and then mythical. This is all kind of like order. And then in all styles. Um, we can just, by the way, do this here. I think this is way easier to just write and, and look at. So we might as well also just form it like this. So just, just drop the road to severities and drop one of the equals. I'm just going to copy this over to our flows as well. And here as well. Okay. Uh, so then, basically in the main, we just want to put this in our functions here. So, uh, function style gets random rarity. And to get our is lucky, which is a boolean uh, question mark, and this will return a string. Then our local chances is is lucky and our is lucky chances and yeah then our this and this. That's pretty much it. Um yeah. And then we just copy this and paste this in our flows. That's pretty much it. Why is it? Why is it warning me here? It's also warning me here. Oh, uh, one, one, one only. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Um. And else, we just want to return rare as like kind of fallback. Uh, okay, we can check uh, is lucky and epic or rare. Like this is what we can do. Uh, yeah. This kind of it. And then in our main, we just want to create all those functions. So our function main random low rarity uh, is lucky is um, a boolean question mark and this is going to return a string then the local rarity is flows make sure you put this at the top here uh, flows get random rarity is lucky there and then local rarity come on rarities oh no return i can't type today Okay, like this. We just copied this function and paste it, and then we get a random style rarity. Make sure you get uh, styles here. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Okay, uh, then we go ahead and do function uh, main get random. Style. I'm going to just get is lucky. 
again. And then we just want to do some local rarity is equal to self dot random. We can just do name random uh, style rarity uh, is lucky. Let's do self. Oh, that's what it does. Self. Uh, yeah. Local pool. Is going to be equal to styles. Of styles uh, with the rarity next. And if not pool or hashtag pool is equal to zero, then it should return rarity, comma nil. And that's going to return rarity. And then pool map dot random uh, one hashtag pool. And yeah, we can just copy the function and just paste it down here. Let's get random flow. And then we can do flows dot flows. And that's pretty much it. So this is our whole function, uh, which we did today. So we can use this in the next episode to kind of build up the flows and kind of roll for them. Uh, but yeah, thank you for watching and see you in the next one. Peace.